What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another episode today. We are gearing up to go on our first trip. So it's been a long past couple days, if you guys have seen, and we are heading out sometime this morning, probably two, three hours. I don't know. We still got some stuff to do, but uh, I'm just kind of packing up the RV now, putting some clothes in, making sure the refrigerator is cooling down so we can throw some food in, and we should be on our way shortly. Those of you who've never towed a trailer, you always want to attach your chains and you always cross them like so. So, got your two chains, make sure your pin is in and that cotter key is tight. Always check that. This, your hitch is locked. Give it a good tug, make sure it's there. And then here, this is our emergency breakaway system. So if uh, for some reason the trailer became disconnected, this gets pulled and it stops the trailer. So the trailer stops moving. Always wanna make sure that's connected, obviously. And we'll do our wiring. So we'll check all these, obviously make sure everything is, is working properly. Got all your hazards, turn signals, brake lights, stuff like that. And we're gonna drive um, a couple minutes down the road and hook all this, hook the car up over there cause it's gravel, we're not on a flat surface. So we're gonna go to this parking lot, it's paved and we're gonna load the car up for the first time. We'll see, uh, we'll see how it goes. the car up for the first time to do that you release this little bracket and then there's this pin here pull that pin out and then step down like that and then all we got to do is drive the car on <laughs> is the theory we'll see how it goes Alright, we have the car loaded. That's the first time we pulled it on. I think it went pretty smooth for our first time. So, that's nice. So, you always make sure you put the pin back. And we use this. Make sure that's tight. Make sure that's tight. And then, we're going to put these... Uh, Gonna put these straps on over each wheel. All right, we uh, got the other side done. I'm gonna show you this side now that I've had a little practice. So these straps actually aren't that bad to use. I was a little confused at first. So this little end here, you got the hook. What you're gonna do is come over on this side. You know, this one might be a little more tough since we're kind of on the seam here. You normally want them right in the center but since we're obviously off just a touch on this side we're just going to go right there what we're going to do we're going to kind of wrap it like that so there's this little top piece this top piece is obviously what goes over the tire right there it's got these two little loops so you feed it through 
that side there. And making sure we're not around any cables or anything in there. And then wrap it around here. Make sure everything's nice and flat. Oh, just like that. And come over to this side. And what you do, you go through that. And we're just going to kind of adjust the ring to where we want it. You want it about center of the tire, like so. And then it just goes kind of hard to see up and under like so. Okay, like so. And you're gonna adjust, obviously, this here, dead center of your tire. And from this point, it's just a ratchet strap. You're gonna feed it through, ratchet it down. Nice and snug, and we'll clean up. Uh, we'll clean these up later. We'll tuck them through and tape them. And then the last thing to do is to hook up those safety chains. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to show you that. I'm just gonna hook them up. Safety chains obviously help keep. If for some reason these failed, safety chains save you so your vehicle doesn't go flying off.